assalamu alaikum viewers today i will discuss about the sum of terms of arithmetic series in this lecture arithmetic series we discuss in previous lecture that if a n is an ap it means arithmetic progression then s n s n is the sum of n terms a1 plus a2 plus a3 so on a n which is equal to n over 2 and into a1 plus a n a1 is the first term of a series a and a n is a last term if we put the value of a n which is discussed in previous lecture also then this formula is can written in form this one Sn is equal to n over 2 and 2a1 plus n minus 1 into d. This formula is used when first term and last term of series is given. And this formula is used when series is given but last term, the value of last term is not provided. So, these two formulas both are for sum of a arithmetic series but the use of a formulas is little bit different from each other. So, we find the sum of series of some question as an example minus 3, minus 1, 1, 3, 5 and so on a16. And if it means 16th term minus 3 plus plus it means the sum we can find the sum of series by using formula which formula a 16 the value of a 16 is not given it means a n is not given then we can't use this formula so I use this formula how? Yes, start. For this formula, we use a n, sorry, a1, n, and d. Three terms are required for solving this. So, it means a1, a1 is the first term. So, a1 is equal to minus 3. First. Then, d is equal to d is a common difference common difference it means the difference between two terms minus 1 minus 3 minus 1 plus 3 which is equal to 2 a1 minus 3 d is equal to 2 and n is a16 16. 16 means total number of terms in this series is 16 so n is 16 here students these three values are given then we use formula for sum s n is equal to n over 2 it means n is equal to 16 16 over 2 2 a1 a1 is minus 3 plus n minus 1 it means 16 minus 1 into d d is equal to 2 calculate then 18 divided by 2 is equal to 8 2 multiply 3 6 6 minus minus 6 plus 16 minus 1, 15, 15 into 2, calculate this, 15 multiply 2, 30, 30 minus 6, 24, 8 multiply 24 is equal to 292, 192 is the sum of series which is given so students 
this is called the sum of series and these two formulas are used for sum to find the sum of a term in arithmetic progression and uh, first question is this and then second question you can see on board yes students you can see the second question find the sum of series 1.11 it means decimal data plus 1.41 plus 1.71 plus and so on up to 10th term 10th term a 10 10th term it means n is equal to 10 and then first value is 1.11 then we can find the difference common difference common difference second term minus minus first term which is equal to 3.0 and uh, by using the second formula of sum we can put value in this formula you can see multiplication difference plus minus and then finally result is 24.6 this is the sum of a, this arithmetic progression i hope you understand this question if you have any problem about this topic then you can mention in comment and we will discuss in next lecture thanks for watching if you like this lecture then like it and subscribe also take care students allah